Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record, 18 wins, three losses, one draw. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 185 and one half pounds. Fighting out of Liverpool, England, presenting the number seven ranked middleweight contender in the world, Darren the Gorilla. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a mixed martial artist, holy professional record, 22 wins, seven losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 186 pounds, fighting out of Wilmington, North Carolina, presenting the number five ranked middleweight contender in the world, Derek Bronson! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 13 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by submission due to a rear naked choke, Derek Bronson! Come on, what's up, baby? My wife, Kayla, my kids at home, I love you guys. I'm here with a very impressive Derek Brunson. Derek, coming into this one, we knew it was a big fight, and you put on a big performance. you got to be happy with that. Oh, yeah, you know, I'm tired of these guys not mentioning my name. You know, Izzy, look at the camera, mention my name. I heard you mention it, Till and Cannoneer. Yeah, because I've been busting my butt four years after my loss to get back to this point. So, yeah, I'm ready to contend. Coming into this fight with Darren, did you see it as basic as if it stayed on the feet, then perhaps that favors Darren, and for you to win, you had to get the takedown? I didn't feel that much. I didn't feel like that so much. I thought I was good anywhere. Um, Henry Hoof and Sanford, I got a good team behind me. Brunson MMA back in Wilmington, North Carolina. It, I was injured all camp, so I wasn't as sharp as I would like to be in the stand-up. But we got nothing but dogs down there that's going to get me ready for any stand-up guy. You know, I got Tyrone Spun, Jason Jackson, and, and those guys, man, they get me ready for these fights. Well, you're certainly in the best form of your life. But let's take a look at your handiwork. Take a look at the screen and talk us through this very impressive finish. Yeah, uh... I saw a submission the whole time, you know, I'm a Henzo Gracie black belt, so I wanted to put it to use, you know, I haven't got a submission late in the UFC, I mean, I was thinking arm bars and stuff like that, but um, nonetheless, man, I'm really good on the ground and want to showcase it. Well, listen, talking of Israel Adesanya, of course, everybody wants to fight for the belt, but you've been there once before and it didn't go your way. You're now on a five fight win streak and I believe Izzy's going to face Robert Whittaker. Are you willing to sit out on the sidelines and wait for that, even if that is an opportunity? Or do you want to just keep taking on the opponents, keep racking up the wins? I'm not broke. I'll sit and wait. You know what I'm saying? I know uh, Izzy and... Um... Whitaker got a fight coming up, I'll sit and wait. That gave me five, six months to go ahead and get my body right and prepare for this really last long title push that I'm trying to make. Well, congratulations on a very impressive performance. Ladies and gentlemen, Derek Brunson. <laughs> <laughs>